Okay. So I know that it's a bad time for a presentation, but I'm going to do my best to be brief, concrete, and useful. So we are going to start okay. with the web page presentation. Um, Tani. No, this is it, this is a web page in the in the cloud in the web. So uh, no. all the information that I'm going to present, you can look for if you put this link outside. I'm going to zoom right now if you want. Okay. So first of all, the web page is yeah. Can you? Tell me. ¿En? No, no voy a poner ningún vídeo ni nada. Ya. Yeah. I'm trying, but I have a technical problem because it doesn't respond. We are waiting. Now? ¿Me haces caso? It's the link is Erasmus Plus dash educarte point EU Erasmus Plus dash educarte point EU and third time the best time Erasmus Plus dash educarte now it works Erasmus Plus <laughs> dash <laughs> educarte point EU okay that is the link for our page this is the page that we are going to use for these two years or for the, the, the project more or less and it's the place that we are going to upload all the documents that Tony said before okay so now I'm going to to show you the public part and more important for us uh, the private area uh, where we are going to upload that kind of documents okay first of all uh, if you put this link in your browser in Google in Mozilla all of them you are going to be di direct to this web page this is the main page of the of the web page and you have information uh, about the last news that we are upload you can change the language here we are, have the page in English and in Spanish the two uh, main languages of this project so in, I maybe I can change to English to show this presentation and you have the the, the last news uh, in the front page and you can click in and go to the new you have a lot of information about the project uh, the means of the project the partners uh, how uh, why we are doing this project I think that we are talked about uh, before so I'm not going to stop in these places if you want to to see these these spaces you can in your mobile phone in your pc you can consult when you want uh, and the other public part that we have uh, is the news as i said we talked about uh, before but it's important that we have clear that all the the entities that participate in this project uh, send news uh, one per month, one per two months, more or less. Because if we don't know what kind of activities are you doing in your country, we can't show. So we need information to, to show that the, the, the activities that you are doing in your countries, in your, in your entities. Uh, so I'm going to give you uh, two important email directions. The first of all is Comunicación in Spanish, communication in English. But if you have, if you put a T, it doesn't work. 
Comunicación. I don't know what in what which I am I'm speaking. <laughs> Comunicación. Eh, arroba in English. That. 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 Thank you. Comunicación at eh, fundación Yehudi Menuhin point o -R -R -G. Eh, All the news that you made for us eh, has to be sent to this eh, direction. Okay. Eh, we need for to, to make a new. We need at least five six lines about what is the activity eh, developed and two or three pictures that that in, in we can show we can see what's uh, the activity doing what's the children or the teachers or the people doing in the activity and it's mandatory to to have news about the lectures and about the workshops as we said before but if you want to share another kind of information that you are doing in your entity and it could be related to the, to this project we can share it too for example I don't know, but I can say. For example, you do a um, um, training meeting in your own country, and we are working about this project in this meeting. We can upload as a new for, for the project. I'm explaining myself? Yes. OK. That's all about the news. Uh, with the content that we received, we uploaded the new, and, and I hope that we have a lot of news about the project and about the, the activities that we are doing there. That's all that we need to know about the public part. The rest of all is our rep responsibility. Okay? So then we go to the private area. First of all, everybody uh, needs a, a username and a password to enter in the private area. Uh, maybe some of you do doesn't have access right now to the private area. So I'm going to pass one, one paper, a piece of paper, and if you want to be allowed to enter in the, in the private area, write your name and the email that you want to have access, and I'm going to, to introduce you in the private area, okay? Uh, I know that some of you have access, but not, of, not all of you, so that's the moment to give you access for this area. And then it's easy to do it. It's like uh, with any, any of other uh, spaces that you have, um, you have permission to enter, put the, the email, you have to put the password. This is not going to show for you because it's No, if you, I, I imagine that you say that Arte for la Convivencia, uh, that you work no, with no, this no, project. No, no, for this one, the, the, the WordPress for Educarte. Yes, if you have the, the, the access for this, that works. it works. Okay. If it doesn't work, uh, send an email to Comunicación okay. too, and we we'll try to fix up. But uh, if you have access uh, right now, it has to work. Maybe not, but it has to work. Mm -hmm. Tell me. Yeah, can you speak about that? Eh, si queréis, para daros de alta en la página web, en la parte del área privada, sí. nombre e email. Vale, no necesito nada más vuestro. Vale, vale. Si queréis vuestra cuenta bancaria, me viene bien, pero... ¿Sabes, José, si bien te he dicho si tiene el si ya correo? Tú has venido aquí, tú date de alta y ya está. Así por si acaso. Mejor tener más... O sea, es gratis. Sí, sí, sí. Así que... No hace falta. O sea, yo tengo mi acceso, yo no necesito. Claro. Yo sé que hay gente de aquí. I know that some people here has access already. Already, but uh, if you want to have access in the future, you can. You have to put there your name or email. Okay, so for the people that I work with them in another project, I think that it is a way to work easier than the others. Nerissa knows because other web pages are a little more difficult than this one. I'm going to explain it, and if you have any doubt about any folder of I am going to explain, tell me, I can't stop, and we can talk about it. This is only a, a proposal, because I think what is the best, uh, but it's, it can change if you want. 
The first folder of all, it's about the partners and the entities collaborating with the partners. We have, uh, no way. We have two folders because we have two, two kind of partners, the, 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 the real partners of the project and then another collaborating entities, as we said before. Uh, so in these pages, we have a folder for each uh, entity, for example, Musa, Musa Belgium. And then we have, uh, in each one, we have a description about the entity and a contact person. So if we need to contact with, for example, with ISTEL or with the Yehode Menohim Foundation in Spain, uh, we have a contact person here with an email and a phone. Uh, that information is struct. Uh, I don't know. It's extraído. It's like extraído. Okay, thank you. Uh, the, the information about the contact person, about the description, is taken uh, by the the project. So the, the project that we present in the CPA, in the Erasmus Foundation in Spain. So uh, if you can, if you want to make any change you have to write to me because you have permission, you're allowed to upload documents, but not for delayed documents or to change documents. You can change, well, or you can change the contact person in your PC and then upload it, the, new, uh, the new document, but you, can, you can't delete the previous one. So uh, if, you have, if you need to delete that one, you have to say to me, because I am the only person allowed. It's uh, for uh, to prevent uh, that we, with without needed, maybe we can delete a document and we um, uh, lost this information. So, it's the it's, uh, we think that is the best um, way to do. So, if you need to make any change, you can do it, but you have to say to me to delete the previous document. Tell me, Sandro. This, uh, this information that yeah. you have uh, in your page yeah. uh, created by you uh, in, in our in our page uh, we create uh, other pages for um, uh, our collaboration uh -huh. school um, municipio biblioteca uh, uh, Partner create your page. Yeah, uh, I don't know uh, how each country is going to organize their information, mm -hmm. ah. but uh, you can decide uh, how you are going to organize. But the mm, the principal, the main way to share the information between all the countries is this place. So if you want to have a, a special part in your web page to organize your country. That's right, I don't mind. I, I'm, not, I'm not going to, to talk to you how to do, how you are going to do. But uh, at the end of the project, we needed some information that is going to be uploaded in this place. Because then when we justify the project, uh, we are going to, to, to give this link. We can choose the information that uh, uh, we think uh, that uh, is necessary for this project. Yeah. I can uh, I can uh, ask uh, Torino or Hungary or Spain uh, that uh, I have uh, I have a need uh, yeah. information for project in Torino in Hungary. Okay. Yeah. Okay. That's the, the main goal of this place of, of this folder is if you want to have contact with another people, uh, you can do it. Okay. It's all the, the goal of this folder. So uh, in, at the beginning, we don't need to upload anything. Nothing is mandatory in this folder. We have mandatory things in the others. OK? So that's the first folder. If, uh, maybe if you want another folders, another entities that you are collaborating, for example, I know that the high schools in Spain doesn't have a, a, hasn't got a folder at this time. If you want a folder for this web page to upload some information that you are doing in your high school or in your entity, we can do it. So all that you want, uh, only uh, you have to tell me, and I, 
I'm only a worker, so if you want something, you can do it. You can have it. It's all, okay? That's the first part. Second folder. Documentation about country. Uh, we thought at the beginning that it's easier uh, to have a folder for each country with folders inside. All the, all the countries are the same, okay? Uh, we have a folder for the articles and news, another one for photos and micro videos, another for didactic units. Uh, then with the models, with the templates, uh, I'm going to explain each one uh, tranquilamente. I, I'm so tired, sorry. <laughs> uh, so, uh, if you want to share an article or the didactic unit or something, you can upload here. For example, we need, uh, we think that the proof of expenses is not needed in this place. In other projects, we do. In other projects, we have a folder for this. Uh, I think that the proof of expenses, for example, is something that each country are mm, uh, handling each one. So we don't need to have a folder for this in this place. If you think that you need it, you can tell me and I ca can do a, fo a folder for this, okay? So, or for example, when, uh, we have to, we can upload the certificates of attendance of a meeting if you, we want. So this is a place that you can use as your choice. I'm not going to say how do you have to make um, use of this place. I'm, I'm explaining myself. So the, this is the folders for the mandatory things of the project. We need articles, we need the multimedia videos that we are talking about before and didactic units. Maybe uh, if you have a huge uh, document, a huge video, a uh, big video, maybe can't be uploaded. So if the video can't be uploaded in this place, you have to send an email to Tony. I think that mm, this mail can, you have got? Okay. This, sec this second direc direction is the Tony's email. So if the video, or if the, maybe mainly the videos, is the main problem with this kind of, of web pages. Uh, for the, the way that it's recorded or and other things, sometimes videos are so huge, are very big. So if you can't upload in the web page, you have to send to projectos arroba at fundacion yehudemenukin.org and by we transfer or by another via that you want. Okay? Tell me, Patrick. And now I'm going to say. Maybe I can start by the end folder is better and then I go to outside. Okay. In the last folder, I'm going to now we are you understand. In the last folder, we have the 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 document, the project documents, and the and the templates for this uh, project. Project documents. We have four documents that are mm, developed by the Spanish entity uh, that the project has said. But if you don't have any notice about it, you don't have to know nothing. So it doesn't mind. And in the models and templates, we have meeting templates and other templates. I'm going to the didactic unit. The only one that we have here right now is the didactic unit. What's that? That is a document. Uh, if you are here, you can download only doing two clicks and you download in your own PC, okay? For example, and it's open. Do you see right here? Maybe better? Okay, we need uh, one didactic unit, uh, one per school per year. For example, in Spain, we are going to, to work in the IES La Serna with the Violeta Friedman Foundation, okay? So we have uh, some, some activities that it's going to do the Violeta Friedman Foundation, the lectures, they are going to do it, and then an artist are going to do the workshops, okay? So, 
the first uh, is general information about what is the subject about we are going to talk about, uh, what is the entity responsible for the lectures and for the workshops, uh, the person responsible, and then we have a space for the lectures description and another one for the workshops description. Here. Uh, one more time, this is only a proposal. Uh, if you could, if you want to take it and do it in your own country with this model, you can do it. But if you want to make any change because it's better for you or for your work, you can do it, okay? We need a didactic unit, but I don't know how is the best didactic unit in your country. I'm explaining myself. Okay, so this is a proposal, and I suppose that in Spain is the, the way that we are going to use. But it not, it's not mandatory that way. It could be another flat, another form. Tell me. But is it possible to, have to, to receive the template? Yeah, this is going to be uploaded in the web page, so you are going to have access, and you can up download from, okay. from there, okay? And if you want, if, because you, uh, you doesn't find it, you, write, you have to write me, and I send you without problem. <laughs> Okay, so this is the, the responsible of the lecture, the subject, and what is the development of the, of the lecture. I think that is mm, simple. It's not a lot of information here. For example, if you, don't have, if you don't use any materials, you can't put materials. It doesn't mind. And then it's the same for, whoops. Why is here dark? Sorry. And then we have the same for the workshop, uh, the artistic work. The same, the, the artist, the artist work subject, and how it's developed this, this activity. Uh, I have to change one thing, and I said that. Sorry. Okay, so when you have your didactic unit, I repeat, you want, uh, yeah, we want one per year per school. So we have our didactic unit, and then we upload in, where? What's happening? Gracias. Dime que no la he liado. Es que eh, en un principio aquí el colegio no va a tener que hacer prácticamente nada. Va a ser más bien entre la entidad, por ejemplo, o sea, será posiblemente la Rey Juan Carlos o Violeta Friedman y tu o sea, trabajo. Ellos, no en principio sí. Ah, o sea, no. Sorry, I, lo I lost my network, so I'm going to. ¿Pero por qué estoy en modo avión? No me cambies. Gracias. ¿Y ya estás funcionando? Estoy en ello. Ya. Yeah. Okay, so when we have the, the didactic unit, we are going to go to the second folder, Documentation Bank Country, and for example, for example if, it's, if it is a Spanish didactic unit, it's going to be in the Spanish folder, in the didactic <laughs> unit folder. If it is an Italian uh, didactic unit, you go into the Italian folder and then didactic unit folder. I think it's easy, that's right. And then we have the information about the meetings. That is the, the main part of this project. Uh, what are we doing in the meetings? Uh, and some of these templates are based on this meeting, on the Spanish meeting. The same, if you want to change something, you can. The only thing that you can't change, I'm going to say, what is that? We need the certificate of attendance, the things that we assigned before, and it's 
the same. I put an example because uh, now we have um, that the, the certificate that you have of this meeting has your name and your entity, but it's a model you have to uh, substitute. It. Oh, you have to substitute these uh, yellow zones for your names, your organizing entity. I think that is mm, intuitive. And you need one certificate for each people that goes to your meetings. One for you and one for the other one to take you to their own home, as, the, as, the, as, we, as we did before. That's right. The other thing that we need is this first. The participant list with the signatures, and it's the same. Uh, in, this in this case, we put the names and the information that we have because we think that it's easier. But if you, can, if you want to print this in blank without nothing, and the people that is in the meeting uh, fulfill the form, it doesn't mind. It, 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 it's valid too. So I think that it's not needed. Oh, the only thing that we have to change, I think, is the, the, the date. Because, OK, I'm going to upload it without the date. Yo me la pongo aquí otra vez. Sorry, sorry. Ya está. Es la costumbre. Es que F2 de toda la vida es cambiar el archivo, el nombre. Pero no me deja. Okay. And the other uh, document that is mandatory for the meetings is the evaluation form. In this case, we uploaded this evaluation meeting. And we, you, we have to maintain the... This is not mandatory. The rest is mandatory because... Or yes. But the one is the place that we are living. This place is from the one. So it's the, the reason that this logo is there. But we don't need it in your, in your, in your meetings, in the Terni meeting or in the Budapest meeting. This logo is not needed. And then we have uh, all the evaluation for each activity that you do in your country. For example, we do after lunch the institutional opening of the event and the presentation of participants. Now we are doing the website and materials thing, and then we are doing another uh, presentations about the Foundation Violeta Friedman, the Rey Juan Carlos University, and all the entities that we are here. So we need to change the, the, the name of the workshops if you are doing another things in your country. It's only a proposal that you have to change for your own country. But the, the form, it, it, mm, it's better if it if maintains that it is in this one. I'm explaining this one, this thing. Okay, so all, no. All this information is going to be uploaded in the third folder, the transnational meetings or encounters. For example, in the Spanish meeting, we have already un uh, uploaded the meeting program because we don't need to do any change here. And we have the agenda that you have in your folders, in your physical folders. Uh, we have the, the same program here. Then when we have your, now we have your certificates of, your certificates of assistance. Then we scan these certificates and are going to be uploaded in this place. The meeting evaluation, the same. The participant list, the same. It has to be uploaded in this place to have all in the same in the same folder, in order to just to justify at the end of the project. Okay, so when you do your meeting, you have to upload it all this kind of information here. That's right. Yeah, the certificate of attendance is the personal certificate that you have with your name that you have in your in your own right now that you signed before and the other thing is the list of participants that you have all the names and sign that they are present i uh, i don't know if it, i have here after yes, 
No, it's only for the transnational meeting. The activities in the school, uh, all the activities that you're doing in the school only, has, uh, only needs a certificate at the end of the year that Tony are going to send you. But uh, we don't need signatures for the children or for the teachers that we are working with us. We don't need it. It's only for the transnational meetings. Yeah, I thought it was for all the meetings that you do. No, only the seven meetings that are yeah, uh, mm, the proposed the by the project. Yeah. Y por si acaso no ha quedado claro y alguien me puede ayudar en, en español. Es uno es personal, ¿no? Y el otro es simplemente para constatar que la gente ha... Claro, antes hemos, o sea, los que hemos pasado antes, hemos pasado una lista con todos los nombres para firmar cada uno la presencia. Un caso personal para cada uno de ellos, eso es lo que le... Vale. It, it's clear? Okay, so maybe uh, we miss some folders, some information, or in the development of the project, we need something else in this place. Uh, the same. Tell me, and I do any change or any modification if you need it to do something. For example, in other projects, some entities want to share their, their work in the in the entity with the rest of the partners because only to be shown, only to to share some more information uh, you can do it if you want and if we want a folder for this we can create it or I don't know but I think that it's easy to work with it and the the main part is that you have access to do <laughs> to it so then give me the page with all of your names and your emails and I don't have to say nothing else, I think. Have you got any doubt about something? I know there's much information and maybe the doubts are going to emerge when we are working with it. Uh, my personal email, if you want, one more, is this one, go ahead. All has the same ending. Uh, my personal name is n u s s dash e at fundacion point o r g. So if you has some problem to access to the web page, or if you want to create a new folder, or if you want to mm, wish me Merry Christmas or what you need, <laughs> this is my personal email. Okay, and um, if. Uh, yeah, that's that's right too. <laughs> so if you han, have got no doubts, I think that I'm going to let Patricia to talk about the Violeta Friedman Foundation. And for my part, that's all. Le aviso, sí, sí. Es que en teoría yo estaba, o sea, era lo que tardase hasta las cuatro y media en teoría con la calma. Yo se lo digo. Okay, so thank you. I'm going to be brief, concrete, useful. Esto lo voy a cerrar.